everybody, this is Simon Sage from iMore. Uh, we are at GDC 2013 and uh, we're visiting the glue offices while we're here in San Francisco. Jason Enriquez here is going to walk us through the uh, the new Frontline Commando game, D-Day. Uh, what can you tell us uh, about the game, how it's different from the, uh, the the previous Frontline Commandos? Sure, sure. So, um, you know, it stays very true to the Frontline Commando um, franchise. You still get that great first-person shooter, third-person shooter actor, uh, action. Um, gameplay but with the Great World War II theme, you're going to see some some ground to air action. Um, you're actually able to uh, control movement as you run uh, through the war zone, uh, which is new to this uh, this game. Um, and you're also going to see a lot of tank action. Um, and the selection of weapons has has definitely um, grown as well. Hmm. All right, so uh, let, let's take a look at the guns real quick then. So you got a full selection there, rifles, machine guns. Uh, I saw AA stuff there on the list too, right? Mm -hmm. That's that seems That's pretty new, right? That is, that is. I um, mean, you can see that you can upgrade the the ability of the the AA weapons, um, which is actually a really fun mode of the game. And we've got the multiple areas there with like different star ratings. How, how are you rated yes. there? So whether it's number of headshots that you accumulate, um, completing the mission in a certain amount of time. Um, completing the mission with a certain weapon only. Um, there, are, there are three different objectives, and if you complete each, um, you know you, you get all three stars. Mm. Mm. Um, and you, you, you have this all upscaled for Retina iPad and everything like that. We do. We do. Well, uh, how about we take a look at the kind of more traditional frontline commando gameplay there? Sure. So you see here again, objective, victory, machine gun only, and target time of two minutes. Sure. So I mean, as always, glue games are, are, are free to play. Uh, yeah. what, 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 what kind of premium purchases are, are you kind of pushing? Sure. So there are always weapon upgrades that uh, you know can can make the the missions a little bit easier sure. if you choose. Um, some of the, the the key consumables are grenades, uh, rocket launchers. Those become important uh, when you get into the later missions where you have tanks or heavy en enemy fire, uh, and then health packs as well, which always you know, help you progress as, as the game gets more difficult. Press forward and force the enemy to retreat. I am a terrible gamer. Do you have any pro tips to help me get further in this game? <laughs> uh, be very careful with um, judicious with how you use uh, your grenades and your rocket launchers. Um, you'll definitely need them later as the tanks and the enemy fire get more difficult. Save the big guns for the big targets? Big guns for the big targets. Awesome, thank you. So, uh, when is this coming out? So this is actually launching this week for GDC. Excellent. It looks like a ton of fun. We will definitely check it out. Thanks, Jason. Of course.